G'day guys, welcome back. Today I'm out here on the in New Zealand, in Tauroa, and today I thought I'd go up in the mountains and look for some chamois. And starting off, we've already got some. We got a female level 3 and a male level 2. They're normally in a large, much larger pack size, and there's another level 2. But I reckon there should be a lot more of them just in the brush that we can't see. There we go. There's more of them. And there's even more up there. Oh! That's a max weight. 54 to 62. That's a that's a big potential diamond already. Diamond's like 57 or something, I'm pretty sure. That is a big chamois to start off. Holy cow. I'm going to take my time with this. I've, I've messed up too many diamonds recently, and that, that very well could be one. I'm not going to take the front on shot. I'm not going for the hard shot with this 243 handgun. It's just, it's just not going to... It's not going to penetrate. I actually might go and get the actual 243 after, so I can try and take some more ambitious shots. But he's just not giving me a shot, and he's like sort of stuck on the spot. So I'm going to have to wait for him to move out a little bit before I can get a good shot on him. So the reason I came out here today is I don't really hunt on Teo or Roa anymore because I just use it for my fellow deer great one grind. And I was like, why not go look for a chamois up in the mountains? Feel like it'd be pretty pretty cool video. Not a lot of people go after Shammy anymore now that they lost their drink time. Oh, he was giving me a shot for a second, but not anymore. Not many people hunt for them anymore because they've lost their drink time. So I thought I'd come in the mountains and try to show you that, show you that the hunting them is actually still very good. But this guy's not, not giving a very good example because he's he's stuck in the one animation. And he's just spinning around in the, on, a spot, on the spot. And it's getting quite infuriating. I just really... There we go. He's starting to... Get a trot on. Hopefully he'll give a good shot in a second. I would have taken that there, but he started running again. Here we go. Bang. That should be perfect. That should have been a good lung shot. Hopefully, at least. Go find out in a second, but we've actually got more of running in front of us. Another level 3 and a level 2. Nothing very special. Yep, and he died. Perfect. So that should be a lung shot. And there he is, there's his dead body. Could we start this video out with a big diamond chamois? Oh, he trolled. 54, diamond's 58. But he does have some very big horns and some nice hooks. He's definitely a pretty good chamois. Probably the best one I've ever seen, to be honest. I haven't I haven't killed a diamond one of these yet. Another reason why I'm keen to get out of here. That, that looks really good. If I could get a diamond one of those today, that'd be... Very good, but unfortunately, we just started out with a troll. But anyway, we'll keep moving. And I just heard some. Oh, and I made him flee, unfortunately, but... There we go, there's still some sticking around. And I have gone back and gotten the 243. It is just much better than the handgun. If I'm um, focusing on a class 3 species today, then I figured it's probably a good idea to get a better gun than a one-shot one shot handgun that's a little underpowered. Just trying to make sure there's no massive one hanging out the back of here, but there doesn't appear to be. And so if there isn't, then I'll take one of these guys out. If this little one will turn, then it'll be our target. Oh, it's hopping around. And there we go. That is going down very fast. That's the difference with the 243 and the 243 handgun. The two, actual 243, the 243 rifle, sorry, is just so much better, so much more powerful, and it's got more shots, so... Definitely, definitely the right move. And anyway, here's our little female. Just a nice little silver at 44. I really like the fur types on the chamois. They're all pretty different, and the colors are actually really good. So the plan for today is to just climb up that mountain, and maybe a couple other mountains. I'm just next to the starting lake on Te Aroa at the moment. It seems to be a really good hotspot for the chamois. If you just run up the mountain, you'll find plenty of them feeding and resting. And it, once you get to the top, you can find them absolutely everywhere. And somehow, while climbing up this mountain, I've managed to walk straight past this little group of little herd of chamois that were feeding or resting. Unfortunately, most of them have fled because I didn't actually know they were there, but... Looks like I'm still going to get the opportunity to take one of them out if she ends up giving me a shot. Ended up going for the next shot for some reason. <laughs> that was not exactly the smartest of moves. I just thought I'd go for the next shot and she slightly moved. So I didn't quite get it, but 
There's another one calling up here, so we'll see if we can find her. And there we go, we've got another... Their warning calls are so funny. I don't know. They just seem really different to anything else I've ever heard before. It'd be pretty cool to hear one of those in real life, I reckon. I've just got to wait for this guy to poke his head over the ridge. He's just resting up there. And that's almost a good enough angle. Just the tree's been a bit of an issue, but that should get him down pretty quick. And we'll go pick him up. Yeah, jeez. He's just done. And I think he's going to slide down the hill. Yeah, he is. Imagine he slides all the way to the bottom of the mountain. Going to have to go catch him before he keeps going. Oh, no. Nah, he slowed down. Never mind. But here he is. Nice little honey tones. Oh, dark brown, apparently. 46 silver with a nice right lung shot. Got a pretty good amount of penetration on that. So I've made it right to the top of the mountain. So what I do from here is I just look down off the edge. And just scan out for some like yellow bodies. Oh, exactly like that. There's a group of resting chamois right up in the trees. I don't see a single male in there yet. So that's a little disappointing, but... As to be expected sometimes, can't, can't get what you want. Just gonna have to make sure there's no guaranteed diamond in there. And then I'll fling a shot into them. I'm now pretty confident that there's no good ones in there. There's, I haven't even seen a single male, and I've been searching pretty hard in this group. So I'm just going to get one of them down, hopefully. This one's a little darker than the rest, so why not I'll take it out? It didn't seem to be happy with that. Doesn't look like I got a vital hit. Not quite sure how, but I definitely didn't. It's not going down, so I guess I'll just fling a couple into it and see if it starts dying. Oh, jeez, that second shot actually hit. It's going down quick now. It's died. Perfect. And there was a male. I didn't see him. Try to take a shot into it. Not quite, I don't think. Don't reckon either of, either of those hit, but I'll just make sure there's no big ones still, because I missed that male. There could be a guaranteed diamond running out of there. You never know. But it doesn't appear to be, so I'll go pick that girl up. And just on the way over, there we go. There it is. We've got a little, little male going alert. And that should be a perfect shot. He should be going down very quickly. And yeah, he is. I accidentally changed... I changed where the marker location was. So I don't actually know where the female from before went down. And I'm currently having a glitch where the dog is just broken. This happens a lot on multiplayer. It just disappears. So I'm just going to have to place a waypoint and hopefully try find it again. But... I doubt that I'm actually going to be able to find that female chamois in the end. Might just keep moving. Keep looking for something a bit bigger. And here we go. Here's the little little male that we shot. Just a 46 silver. Honey, turns, honey tones fur type. So. And I've actually gotten the, the host of this server. So, I don't know. If it gets too dark, I could change it around. But as you can see, I'm right up at the top of this lake here. At this mountain here. Hopefully that guy doesn't come up to the mountain and start spoken off my chamois, but anyway, we'll keep going. And I've actually picked up another max weight chamois track. Max weight is 57 to 65 kilos, as you can see in the top right corner. So the plan is just to follow this for a little bit until I find him, because this should be a potential diamond, I think. And I've just spooked some off, but I think he should be... Oh, is that him on the road? <whistles> yes, that is. Up to 57... Doesn't exactly have a good chance. Actually, he doesn't have a chance at all, unfortunately, but... If he gives me a shot, I'll take him out, and that... that would definitely do, and he's going down quick. Unfortunate that I've been tracking this guy for, like, kilometers on kilometers just for him to be a guaranteed trail, but... It's alright. And here he is. Jeez. He actually wasn't bad at all. A nice gold at 54.97. He's not far off diamond at all, but... Obviously, he couldn't quite make it. And I think there is some chamois just up here on this mountain. I swear I saw something moving, but... Something moving. And there's one up here as well. That is definitely the wrong set of binoculars. Sorry about that. That's probably a bit blinding. But he is 50 to 57 kilos. Up to 42. He's just a small one, but... That should, in theory... Jeez. 
absolutely demolish him. And yeah, there are some running down from up there. I was right. I did see some. Wasn't going crazy. But they both appear to be very small so far. But that shot did seem to be good. And he's just been demolished. And there's another couple coming. So, I don't know if there's a good one in there. Then I might chuck, fling some more lead out there. But everything seems to be pretty small as of right now. But I might just reload and take that 50 to 57 out anyway. And there's one running, running right to me. He's coming to say hello. Just a small level 2 though. So, I'll let him go. And... If I can spot the... There he is. Get another shot into him. And that... Might have been... Yeah, it was. It was good. And absolutely demolished him. So, three flat and shammy up in the mountains. We'll go pick them up. And the first one's just a nice little silver. And the second is also another nice little silver. It's a nice lung and liver shot. And the third one, once again, is another little silver. But that's alright, we'll just keep looking, hopefully find some bigger ones in a sec. And I am still right up in the mountains, and it is treating me very well. There's a lot of chamois out here, and I definitely recommend you guys to check it out, because it's actually very fun. Another positive is how pretty it is up here. You get such a good view. Oh. Oh, oh, oh. That's another max weight, 54 to 62. Well, I was very relaxed for a second, but never mind. That is a very big chamois right in front of me. Another potential diamond. I've been trolled twice now, I think. This would be a third unless he makes it, but hopefully, third. You, you know what they say, third time's a charm, so hopefully it goes like that and he will make it. And here he is. Oh, just another gold at 55.5. His horns are really tall, but unfortunately didn't quite make it. Wasn't third time's a charm. Three trolls back to back to back. Definitely not the way I planned this hunt to go, but it's alright. We'll just keep going, I guess. Eventually, we're bound to get one. And there is another little pack of them down here. It actually might be the same one as the, as the chamois we just spooked after shooting that big guy before. But there's definitely nothing special in there, so it definitely well could be. But I might take that one out. Should be a good shot. Or apparently not. Never mind. Wasn't a good shot. Was that one? No. So some very poor accuracy. A little disappointing, but maybe we'll get another shot up here. Might just lob another shot in. That's a level 1. I've never seen a level 1 chamois before. That's going to be the smallest one I've ever seen, but... Yeah, no, they don't seem to be giving me a shot. Unless I just send one out here. No. Went behind her. So those guys are just going to get away free. But that's alright. And I'm just right at the top of these mountains. And it just looks so incredible up here. And it's a very good spot to search for the chamois as well. You can find a lot of them. There's like... Way more than I expected to find, to be completely honest. I didn't really have much of a plan. I sort of just marched into the mountains and started searching for them. But I can't see another one yet. But soon enough, we will. There's definitely some in here somewhere. Oh, yep, right on cue. Just to level 3. Goes up to 53. I'm going to just march my way down the mountain, get a little bit closer, and try and get a good shot on him. Well, I didn't end up finding that chamois. He ended up leaving. But if you just saw that, there's a level 150 down here. There's, w what is going on here? That's a little bit interesting, to say the least. Might have to leave this server in a second, but I kind of see what's going on here. Are they just farming diamonds? What the? What is this? I've never been in the server where the, when I've actually been able to see this happen before. Anyway, this seems like a pretty fitting way to end this video. So if you guys did like this video, please like and subscribe. I'll see you next time.